Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So it seems that Microsoft is finally going to be making progress towards finishing dark mode in Windows 11. And as you may well know, dark mode was introduced in Windows 10 back in 2016, but has been incomplete with a lot of major user interface inconsistencies with modern parts of the OS supporting dark mode, while legacy aspects are not, and you can see this looks horrendous, looks totally inconsistent and out of place. And if we head to just another legacy component like Device Manager, you can see the same thing applies. Although I've got dark mode set, bright white in other areas, mainly the legacy components of the operating system. Now, as mentioned, this looks like it's finally going to be changing. And as spotted by Phantom of Earth on X, and if we head over to an image provided, yeah, we can see that in the latest Insider Preview build for Windows 11, which is build 26100.5061, I'll leave the video I posted on that late last week linked down below in the end screen because it's a big update that's going to be arriving over the next couple of days and has 18 new features, bug fixes, and much more. Check the video out for more info. But nonetheless, in that build, Microsoft has included dark mode now for the file copy, file deletion, and the permissions pop-up window, which currently in the stable version are all still white theme and light mode, even if you have dark mode enabled and I think this is a very nice move in the right direction and we can see now because of this it just brings a more consistent uniform feel to the operating system when these user interface surfaces are themed correctly. Now it kind of makes me wonder why Microsoft is taking so long to fix these inconsistencies with dark mode in Windows 11 and even over on Windows 10 to some degree or the other. And although there is still a lot of legacy user interface surfaces and components that need to be themed correctly if you have dark mode applied, I still feel at least this is a move in the right direction, as I would say on the channel. And this is in the release preview channel as a hidden feature. So Microsoft hasn't acknowledged this officially. Hidden features are code that Microsoft is working on internally and hasn't enabled yet. So I certainly hope that some of these changes start trickling through to the stable version sooner than later. And obviously, when I get knowledge of that, I'll keep you in the loop. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.